I'm Katie Maher. I'm from Iowa. Came out on vacation 15 years ago and never left. Colorado's paradise. It's home now and I'm never leaving. What brought me to painting was the other local artists in Salida. Um, I had a tattoo shop here, which was really fun. Coloring on people is great, but um, this way no one gets hurt. I can spill. If I'm totally honest, I'm trying to see with how, how little I can get away with, how few times I can touch this and it still look amazing because I think why people like these so much is because of what's left out, not necessarily what's in it. Um, your, your brain has to fill in what's left. And so your brain's different every day, uh, every minute. And every time you look at this, it's different. So it keeps it interesting. And really you're just falling in love with your own brain, not the pain. <laughs> So I'm trying to mimic movement with these, you know, it's a live animal. I want it to look alive. And I noticed that when I chop things into geometric shapes and flip warm and cold colors, it starts to vibrate in your vision and look like movement. It's almost hard to focus. It makes your eye bounce. And I had to make up a word because I didn't never really seen this before. I don't, I don't know. It's a, it's a combination of a lot of different styles. So I call it fractured um, because of all the fracturing of the shapes. And it just seemed to fit. I love working with the portfolio gallery. The events they host are blast. They set me up outside. They have live music. I get to paint. I get about 5 million compliments all in a row. It's, it's really a good time. Um, they've provided me with more space and freedom to really drop in and, and do better art um, without having to manage my own gallery so much. Um, I'm really grateful for that. When the goal is just to have fun and to play, you don't necessarily need to know the rules. It's nice to know color theory and things like that, but really just to break those rules is the only reason you need to know them. Um, I think when I can get out of the way and just show up and let whatever happens, happens, you know, you start with an idea. I want this moose to be in blues and oranges. I want it to be, you know, overall a calm mood, you show up, you start. But the minute you do something, you have to make a new plan based on what's already there. So you have to let go of that idea and make a new one. And so it's a constant let go of what you wanted it to look like and what does it look like. Kind of a life practice too. <laughs>